Vonda Hedarian joining us for some new segments. Today we're focusing on our legs and paying a little more attention to actually breaking them down. So we're going to uh, do lunges, but we're going to isolate. We're going to go from one stage to another yes. and really isolate the legs. Yes. So a lot of us are doing reverse lunges or front lunges in the gym, which are great, which are great for quads and for hamstrings and for glutes, right? You can do reverse lunges or you can do front lunges. You can add the weights. You can add a straight bar on your back to take it a little bit farther. I'm going to have you work on the stepper. Okay, and okay. we can do it together. So we're doing one leg squat, but this time you're extending the leg in front, so you're working on your hip flexor as well in the same time. You use the bar at the beginning, you lower 90 degrees, and then you push it back up. And you take your time and push it back up. Now I have the stepper there just as a, as a point of where you want to sit, how much you want to bend the leg. So you sit on it, but you don't rest. You might want to go a little bit closer to the back. Okay. You just touch the stepper and coming back up. Good. Now you really feel this you, too for some exactly. of us who have very weak yeah. hip flexors. You'll feel it there. It's your hip flexor, it's your abdomen, it's your quad working as well. And so you're then seeing you, much more isolation in, in the glutes when you're pushing up on the leg that's on the bottom. And then I've seen you that you could literally just stand there and do it without anything, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you just go and do it. Yeah. That takes a lot. That's amazing. But those are definitely progressions. You feel that. Yeah. 